Babe. Hey. Ready to take it back to where it all began. Yes. So close. <laughs> so close. <laughs> On your face. Down your shoulders and back. We are surrounded by all of these lies and people that talk too much. You got the kind of look in your eyes as if no one knows anything but us should this be the last thing i see i want you to know it's enough for me so well they've been spending the entire day together they got brunch together this morning they went for a walk in edworthy park which is a really special place to them and then uh, later on sam went for a massage on her own then they went hit the hot springs together to really relax before they went to juniper bistro for a really beautiful dinner Hey babe. Hey. Has anyone told you yet tonight that you're the most beautiful girl in the entire world? No. And that when you smile, <laughs> you melt people's hearts? No. Oh. Well, you are. Stop. And then they're on their way here any minute. I'd like to say what I love about Sam and Mitch is the fact that you two uh, start and end with love, that it starts with love for the church and love for each other and for your friends and family and uh, you love the music which brought this all together. And I just want to say congratulations to you guys. I'm so excited for you. So excited to stay here. Um, I just love seeing the way that God brought you guys together, um, the way that you bless one another and bless those around you. It's such intentional relationship. Um, so yeah, I'm so excited for you guys. Congratulations. I love you. What I like about Sam and Mitch is that they balance each other out. Mitch is intense Woo! sometimes, while Sam is the calming voice to it. I wish them very well on their upcoming night. Sam, Mitch, uh, we're so excited for you guys and one thing that I just really want to share with you and it's something that um, Robert and I have learned but a few things is one is communicate, uh, another that I would love to tell you is that um, you just shouldn't go to bed angry at each other. Just make sure that, you know, if you guys are talking about something or you're arguing a little bit, make sure that you settle it before you guys go to bed and thirdly but most importantly, um, keep God first, keep Him in the center of your your relationship in the center of your marriage. Um, that's my advice to you. So happy for you. We love you, Sammy. We love you, Mitch. And we're, we love that you found each other. And we're really excited for what life is going to bring you. We have some words of wisdom. Um, one is that... Uh, that you always remember to be kind to each other. And the other is to be patient to each, with each other. Remember to be patient. And laugh a lot. Yeah, laugh a lot laugh because a lot. there's humor in, in every situation, even when it's not a humorous situation. <laughs> so <laughs> laugh a lot because laughter really lightens things up. Yeah. And we love you. Babe. Yeah. You're blindfolded. Yeah. <laughs> How do you feel? Uh, vulnerable. Yeah? Yeah. Are you scared? Nope. No? I trust you. Are you excited? So excited. Okay. I have no idea where we're going. That's good. <laughs> okay, it's good to be fun! <laughs> Oh, 
I know I've said it before, but thank you all so much for being here. I know it means a lot to me, but I know it would mean the world to Sam. And so um, it just, it's great that you could all just share in this moment. Uh, it's huge for me, and, uh, and it just, yeah. There's, no, there's nobody else that would rather be here than, than you all, and, and you're my family, and, and we all love you. Like, we love you. And so thank you so much for being here. Part of it. Oh. <laughs> we got some baristas on staff. I'm going to some tacos. So we got some time, so let's just hang out, drink some coffee, and uh, have a good time. Thank you. Yeah.